Okay, you two, it's Lawman FJ. I'm gonna to attempt to walk you through the booting process for the Nexus uh, 6P. Now, before you do that, you gotta have this Nexus Rule Toolkit downloaded. This is the icon right here, and I'm gonna show you how to get it. So you just go into your, go into the web, search for Nexus Rule Toolkit, and you'll see it come up. Work fresh toolkit is what you want, and it'll give you the latest version. If you don't get the latest version, when you open up the app, it'll look for the latest version and download it for you. That's where you get it from. You go to the web, type in the search bar, Nexus Rule Toolkit, and you get the work fresh version, and you're good to go. And once you open up the Rule Toolkit, it's gonna to ask you if you wanna download the latest version of Twerp. You're gonna say yes. Go, go ahead and do that. And then you're gonna get the toolkit itself open up, all right? So first thing you're gonna do is go to find your build number. Now. As you can see, I have the any build uh, uh, version running right now, but you can change that by going in here, finding your device, and then you can look for the build number, right? I have any build right now, but you can you can find the one that fits your phone if you wanna do that. Or you can auto detect by hitting this, this tab right here. It'll auto detect your phone and uh, you'll be good to go if you're unsure, all right? Now, once you do that, you click on apply. It's going to tell you that uh, you've got to have USB debugging ready to go. All right. Now it's going to be updating the uh, toolkit. Let me pause for a minute. All right. So once all that's set up, you're ready to go. All right. So you're going to unlock your bootloader, hitting the unlock button right here. That's going to wipe your device. So you got to back it up. Make sure if you want, you know, make sure you don't lose any files. Hit unlock and it's going to unlock your bootloader. That'll be pretty quick. Then once you do that, then you're going to root. Make sure you got custom recovery check right here in this box, so you can add uh, the custom recovery, which is a uh, twerp. It'll add that for you automatically. And that's that's as simple as that. That's how it's going to work. And you just got to follow the prompt, and everything will be fine. And it'll be quick and easy. Now, if you have a problem, if you get soft brick or boot loop, you can go here and flash stock and unroot. And it'll flash the stock ROM if you if you got a brick, all right? So it'll download the image for you. That takes a while. So be patient. And then it'll load it and flash it. If you want to unroot just because you don't like root, you can hit the same button to unroot your phone. But this will fix almost anything you have wrong with the Nexus 6P if you have a problem. You're going to have to get it back to normal. And that's what this does right here. This toolkit is great, man. It works really well. So I've done it a few times where I've had to. I've had a boot loop and I've had a soft brick. And so I had to flash uh, stock to uh, get it back to normal so this will do that for you all right if you have a problem where your phone is not getting recognized because you know you can't and you can't get started go up here to the full driver installation guide it's probably because your driver is not updated so you want to make sure you follow these steps to get the right driver on there now i also tell you that if you have an old computer it's going to have a problem so just got to beware of that all right uh, but if you got a new computer, it's going to be fairly well, no problem, and everything will go pretty smoothly, okay? So that's how you root the Nexus uh, 6P. Pretty easy. If you got any questions, you can hit up in the comments. I'll be happy to help, but it's easy, man. So go ahead and do it so you can get that uh, get that phone rooted and start uh, flashing some uh, some zips to it, all right, to get it, get it where you want it, okay? Okay, YouTube. So uh, we just went through how you root the Nexus 6P, all right? Uh, I know that was a simulation. I didn't actually go through it with the device, but it's pretty simple. I'll tell you, I guarantee it, you have no problem. Now, but this is just 6P once it's rooted. Um, you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna see that you'll have root access because you have super user icon right there. That'll be on your device, so you'll be rooted. All right, and you can also check it with root checker to make sure you're good to go. And you you know you download BusyBox uh, also so you can function properly. And sometimes it does that automatically, but if not, you want to download BusyBox, all right? Now, I have a couple of other apps uh, like Flash Fire and um, the uh, Nandroid Backup, you want to, you know, so you can make your backups. You want to get those apps so you can use them uh, when you uh, are rooted it with a 6P. Now, to get the, to flash the zips for the uh, Pixel XL, because that's what this phone is, it's a Pixel uh, 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 when, they, when you load it onto the computer, it recognizes a Pixel XL, all right? That's what it recognizes. See right there, Pixel XL, that's what it is, 7.1.1. 1. 1. 
and it's running the latest build that the Pixel XL is running, NMF260. That's what's gonna happen when you get this uh, flash on there. So, now, your phone is rooted and you're ready to flash. So you're gonna go to the uh, Gadget Hacks website. I already had it downloaded, and it's, it's this is the website. Get night moves, get night light and moves to turn your 6P into a Pixel. And, and Gadget Hacks did a great job. And this is a full tutorial, it walks you right through it. Now, as you can see, you've got to be rooted because it won't work without being rooted. You got to have a custom recovery installed, which is your twerp. You'll get that when you root. And these are the files, all right? So you're going to download the Pixel Experience Zip uh, Part 1 and then the Pixel Experience Zip Part 2, all right? And that's how you get the, uh, you flash both of those and you, you'll get the Pixel uh, set up on your device. And you'll be good to go. Simple as that. So you just download those, you, you open them up, and she's telling me I already got it downloaded, but you're gonna, you can replace it if you want, but download the files, all right? And then um, once you download it, then you're gonna go into recovery. So you boot your phone into recovery, So like I said, you're gonna boot your phone to recovery. Now the easy way to do that, you can do that by using the uh, the side buttons, power button and the, and the power down and the volume down, they're gonna get you into recovery. Press that for a few seconds, you get into recovery. But the easy way to do that is to use an app. So if you got the Nandroid uh, backup app, uh, app uh, downloaded, you can open it up and you can slide over to recovery and you can reboot into recovery. And it's gonna reboot your device into recovery, all right? Now, once it gets into recovery, then you're going to flash those zips. I'm not going to actually flash the zips because uh, I don't need to. So right, I've already done them. Now, that's team win and in, in recovery, right? All right, then you're going to hit install. And you're going to see those two zips that you downloaded. That's one right there, version eight, and update version nine. And you're going to down, you're going to click those, and when you click them, you're going to hit, you're going to slide to the right, and you're going to install. Then you do the same thing for both. All right, and then you're good to go. Okay. So once you get done. Cause when you so you're going to flash both of them but you flash one go back and you hit install again and flash the other and then you hit reboot uh back into uh your regular screen all right once you get done reboot back uh, this, this system all right and said so it's going to reboot your device now of course once you uh do that your phone is going to reboot and you're gonna have the boot animations for the Nexus for the Pixel XL. And uh, let me get let me get back into my device here. Okay, and you're gonna have a Pixel XL format there. All right, once you get done. Now, uh, this is real simple, y'all. Uh, you can't get any simpler than that. And I tell you, I love this Pixel XL build because uh, it gives me everything the Pixel does even with the uh, notification pull down, everything, all right? All that works, um, and you get the same software as a Pixel XL. So you gotta try it, because I'm running a Pixel right now, front-facing speakers, and I didn't pay a $1,000 for it, all right? Nexus 6P, all right? So you gotta, gotta use that. Now, I know I didn't actually go through all the steps, you know, like actually flashing the phone and all that stuff, but if you follow this, it will work. The Gadget Hacks tutorial is great really simple to use if you have any questions just let me know i'll be happy to help you out because this is easy and if you have any problem it's easy to fix so go ahead and do it live on the wild side flash your nexus 6p get a pixel xl for free all right this is lawman fj if you like the video give me a thumbs up and if you got any uh if you haven't subscribed yet go ahead and just hit the subscribe button down below and uh, stay tuned for more videos like this and if you got any questions again ask me about them i'll be happy to answer this is lawman fj out